Hey guys, happy Monday. Hope you had a wonderful weekend. I sure did. Let's get into today's video. So as you guys know, a little while ago, I had four plants herm out on me. Luckily, I did pull them before the plants were totally ruined. Um, I still don't really feel like smoking seedy wheat. This led me to ask myself, what can I do with the remaining bud that's not going to cost me a fortune? I did a bit of research online and I finally came across the product called a bubble bag. More specifically, bubble bag dude. Bubble bag kits come with between four to eight bags depending on what you're looking for. Each bag has a different numbered micron mesh in the bottom um, to let different degrees of uh, quality fall through. What it's used for is making what's called ice hash. So once you buy the bubble bags, all you need are three things. You need your herb, water, and ice. But without thinking about it too hard, I ordered a set of one gallon bubble bags. It just so happened to show up today. Here we go. Uh, this is it. As you can see, I already opened it just to make sure this was my parcel and not my wife. Alright ladies and gentlemen. Here it is. As I said, I opened it because I didn't know if it was mine or if this was something my wife had ordered. Um, but lucky, lucky me. So, pull these out. This is it. This is the carrying case, Bubble Bag Dude. This is the brand I purchased. Um, seemed to have the best reviews. From what I could tell, it was the best quality of bags. So, get this out of here. Pull out our paperwork. Um, this is an instructional pamphlet which walks you through the process of how to make ice hash or bubble hash. Um, here is a little card basically thanking you for your purchase um, with Bubble Bag Dude and telling you if you have any questions or concerns, contact them, not eBay or Amazon, wherever you bought it from. Thirdly, we have this nice Bubble Bag Dude sticker which uh, I actually like. I'm not sure what I'm going to put this on, but. I'm gonna put it on something. Now, lastly, but certainly not least, we have the bubble bags themselves. I bought a four bag kit um, as opposed to a five or an eight bag kit. I think four should do um, for my application. I don't need six different qualities of bubble hash, right? Three is gonna be fine. So, what we have here is the blue bag. On the bottom, you can see the, uh, the mesh. Each bag, like this one, is a 220 micron. Um, the yellow is 73 micron. Orange is 120, and the purple is 25. So basically, you stack these bad boys inside of each other, put them in a bucket, and put your curb in there, put your water in there, put your ice, uh, get a paint stick or something, mix it all up for a while, and then start straining and each bag your first one will obviously have your shit in it that you're going to throw away because that's all your old byproduct then you're going to have um, your least quality and then you would have um, your seconds and then you have the prime stuff at the bottom I've never used these but I've seen lots of videos since I've ordered it it also comes with a pressing cloth um, to dry your final product so that is the bubble bag guys I might show you a video of me using it um, I don't know if that'll be tagged on the end of this or not um, so you better wait till the end of this video to find out and if you've made it all the way to the end of this video I want to thank you guys so much for taking a little bit of your time out of your day to come and spend it here with me Chris at Bikes and Bud and until next time don't forget I love you guys and each and every one of you are capable of greatness